What a day. Hey guys, uh, welcome back to Alternative Inverts. So we've just got back from the uh, Eastern Invert Show in Bedford. What an absolutely amazing show. I've got loads of pickups. We're now broke, going to be living off beans on toast for the next four or five weeks, but sad it, it's well worth it. So today, I'm going to run through just what we've picked up from the show, and then we're also going to announce the winner of our 100 subscriber giveaway. Thank you to everyone who's entered the giveaway, um, just by adding a comment to the video for the last three videos. So good luck to everybody. But first, let's just find out what we have picked up. Pick the dog up. Um, if she was at the show, we'd have probably give her away rather than <laughs> got her. And a little nose to see what we've got. So we've got a couple of enclosures uh, which we got from Tarantulas Online, I believe it was. Uh, so we've got these two round enclosures. Can you move your snout? Go on. Uh, these two enclosures. We've got this other enclosure up here from Tarantulas Online. Uh, yep, so that's enclosures from there. We have multiple other enclosures. Um, that we have got from, uh, where did we get these from? Fat Bob's Exotics. That's where we got those from, Fat Bob's. What a guy. We also have some other enclosure that we had, which has got an amazing build in it. Let's just get some good look at this. Uh, flip the light off for me. Assistants. Yeah, so this is it. It's a Team Wolf. Um, enclosure that's been designed the curse of the werewolf caught back awesome little uh, teen wolf guy and some bits of stuff at the back decoration in a nice wooden cabinet a lot of efforts gone into making this and we've also got a blue light uh, which is LED so it won't it shouldn't affect the uh, the tarantulas and it was Steve Mills who's designed this so go check him out on Facebook I'll put the link in the description he's got some awesome enclosures and he's normally at all of the shows as well so go check him out we also got a free bag of substrate from Steve as well <coughs> uh, what else did we get this which I pre-ordered from a uh, dead set company so make sure you go check them out and this is a Silence of the Lambs piece as I'm sure you're all aware absolutely love this film uh, so it's something that's going to go up in our invert room in the new house the wife bought me a uh, bat um, taxidermy bat and this was bought from Remains to be Seen this is absolutely amazing and I love the frames um, that they, they put their sort of dead animals I suppose in they're absolutely awesome some bits of decor just dandelion and plantain yeah uh, some sort of moss uh, we've got a bag of uh, oak leaf <coughs> and we also got some more cork bark from fat bubs uh, we've got a few bags of already mixed substrate because I know that what we've already got over here just isn't going to be enough for what we've bought here. So, uh, bought some more mixed substrate, uh, bought a few more blocks of substrate. We also have a Malteser, which my wife is going to eat now because she loves chocolate. <laughs> eat it. I have a. Not going to show you that yet. We. Got gifted this, uh, so we won this from the raffle, um, and you could choose what you wanted. So I chose the uh, Poclotheria regalis, juvie, whatever you want to call it, tiny little guy, uh, yeah, awesome, active. Um, that was meant to be £9. We got gifted this from Scott Tasker. Um, so this is of his breeding project, I believe, um, and this is a, a true uh, form of a curly hair. So it is the oh. Albopolossum Nicaragua, or a Nicaragua. <laughs> I have no idea how you pronounce it, uh, but it's a, it's a, a curly hair basically. Um, so that's awesome. Thank you, Scott. Scott is also uh, the. 
uh, owner of the Pets UK Facebook group. So make sure you go and check that group out and um, follow the group, join the group, post pictures to the group, comment, help everybody else on the group, uh, ask any questions if you have any. Uh, the link is in the description, so make sure you go check that out. Uh, we got gifted a keyring, so we we saw uh, Princess Selfie Pink as soon as we got uh, as soon as they got to the show. Uh, we were in the queue and they were just behind us, so they came up and um, Holly gave me a keyring as well, which is amazing. Uh, so thank you, Holly. A uh, Bracky Palmer Kallenbergi, which is the New Mexican tarantula, and we got this from tarantulasonline.com, which is the same place that we got. Pamphobetus Cascada which we wanted and it was on our list before we went these were the only guys that I seen that had this Pamphobetus today um, we also got another spider that was on our list and again I didn't see any other store or, or, or shop have have these in and this is the Forminoculus Carpentary which is the uh, <laughs> Sulawesi Black Again, I hope I'm pronouncing that right because you know what my pronunciation's like. It's and let's just take a look at this little guy. It is just here. These are absolutely beautiful, and I will pop a picture of a adult on the screen. It's the Kallenbergi, the Brachypelma Kallenbergi. Next, we have this was a free gift, so I will explain this after. Um, so we went to. Um, Tarantula shop, but it's also an uh, Asian um, Theraposidae or Theraposidae or however you pronounce it. Again, you know what my pronunciation's like, it's cack. And I bought a Forminoculus Everetti female, and that was a hundred pounds. And she's absolutely beautiful. Let's see if I can uh, get my assistant to open this for me. Can And there she is, absolutely gorgeous. And if you check out his Facebook too, uh, the page on Facebook, um, he actually recently put a picture up uh, a few days ago of her uh, on a branch, but under under some proper lighting. Um, and it was this exact spider, and she looks absolutely beautiful. Uh, so if you are on Facebook and you do have them on Facebook, go and check that out. We wasn't sure whether to get the Forminoculus Everetti um, or whether to go for the, um, well, I'm not even going to try and pronounce, pronounce the, the full name. It's a C. Jose uh, Citharognathus. Citharognathus. Jose, maybe. Maybe right. Not sure. It is this. So. We was tossing up the idea whether to buy this sling. This sling was uh, meant to be £60 or whether to buy the Formunoculus Everetti female for £100. Couldn't really decide. I know the missus wanted one of these. Uh, so the Jose is basically the uh, Borneo Bat Eater, uh, is the common name. And she'd been looking at these. They were on our list, uh, but we also had an Everetti on our list as well. We went, decided to go for the Everetti, and nevertheless, at the end, um, uh, Dominic just pulled this out anyway and just gave us one as a gift. Um, couldn't thank him enough. Absolutely fantastic. Um, and he says that he's he's happy um, that you know other people are as enthusiastic about Asian arboreal species as he is. Um, so absolutely fantastic. Can't recommend him enough. Make sure you check their Facebook as well. They will also be down in the link as well as the website which is tarantulashop.eu uh, So go check them out guys. It's, we have we picked up a oh, this is a sex and scope that the wife brought me. Uh, so I do have some lenses already but she's got me another uh, a proper sex and scope here from Spider Shop which is cool. So thank you to the wifey, the lifey. Uh, we picked up a Monocentropus Balfouri female from uh, Emil at uh, Spider Planet. She's a beaut. I've already tried looking at her, and as soon as I do, straight up threat posture. So she's just as lovely and kind as my mature male.
well, nearly mature male. Um, look at that. There she is. Beaut. So, I'm going to be leaving it uh, until after another malt, maybe two, and then I'm going to be um, kicking off a breeding project with the Balfouris as well. Fuchsias, a Fuchsias species gold female. Uh, that was £35 from so many legs. Um, and these guys look absolutely beautiful. The web is awesome. I'm not going to be able to see if I can get it, but they're really fast species. Um, so to see this, you're going to have to wait for the rehouse um, because I'm not risking it going darting across the living room when I've got all this stuff around because I'll never catch it so watch the rehouse for this but it's not one you'll want to miss they are absolutely beautiful Dread, uh, red runners uh, 100, 200 and 300 down the bottom and we're going to be starting our colony of red runners mystery box from Portsmouth Tarantulas and this is going to be opened in a separate video and the wife wanted to have a go at doing a video for the channel uh, so you're going to have this ugly face <laughs> doing a video uh, for you soon so make sure you tune in and check that out for when she's doing an unboxing and rehousing of this mystery box and finally and I couldn't believe it that I found one for this cheap so the thing we did was walk into the um, walk into the show and as soon as we walked into the show uh, the spider shop was sort of on your left and the first thing that my wife saw was a uh, Biru for £120 um, and usually they're what, around £300 but no, a third malt uh, Birupis Simorongsigorum <laughs> I'm no good at pronouncing it Simoroxigorum Simoroxigorum? Serumoxigorum. Whatever it is. It's a biru, yeah? It's a biru, and we got one for £120. And I thought, wow, they've only had three or something. And I thought, they're going to be gone fast. I'm going to buy one. End of the show, I was still the only person who bought one. And I thought the price was absolutely amazing. You can just see a little batty underneath the... Uh, what's it called there? But it's going to be too hard, I think, for the... the camera to spot it but nevertheless you'll see in the rehouse uh we have a beer apiece. so yeah been an awesome day awesome bunch of tarantulas that we've collected don't know what's in the mystery box as of yet plenty more enclosures and bits and bobs and decorations and stuff met some great people uh so let's flip around yeah so we met some amazing people we met a um, few people who watched the channel as well, which was amazing, and they come up and said hello. Uh, we had Courtney, um, so thank you for coming up, Courtney. And also we had Sean Murphy. Uh, so thank you guys for popping over, saying hello. Um, a few other people as well. I can't remember everybody, sorry, but thank you for coming up and saying hello. We met um, some other YouTubers as well. Uh, so me and Rachel... Uh, went out and had a few drinks with Sam from Bug Realms and Kelly from Critters and Creations. So we went out for a few beers with them last night uh, in Bedford Town and then saw them again today at the show. I had a quick catch up again today at the show. We met um, Amy from Pet Rock and Rolls. It was not lovely to meet Amy. Um, so, yeah, we also saw Pete Webster again. Uh, it's always a pleasure um, having a little chat with Pete. Um, we also met Daniel Cousin uh, Cousins, who is Cousin Feral Ferret on YouTube. Um, again, first time meeting the guy, absolutely amazing, sound guy, uh, likes good music. And we also met uh, Princess Sophie Pink as well and um yeah absolutely amazing all of them were great had a good chat with all of them um so yeah we, we we've had a good day all in all uh, with the breeders that we normally talk to as well um people other youtubers people who've been speaking to over the youtube and over the internet and over facebook uh, so it was an absolutely fantastic day couldn't have gone any better um we got a great bunch of pickups and yeah Looking forward to the next show, the Brighton show on the 16th, 
no, the 16th of Saturday, on the 17th of November. Uh, so big shout out, make sure that you go, these shows are absolutely amazing. Always great group of people there, um, great selection of spiders and other inverts. Even if it's not something that you collect yourself, just take your kids for the day out, um, let them experience handling some inverts. Um, they do also have some other mammals there that you can handle as well and other reptiles. Um, so make sure you go and check out this show on the 17th of November. Um, I think we will be there quite early. Uh, Lee from the Spider Shop has asked if we want to uh, attend uh, with the Spider Shop uh, to get early access just so we can get some uh, good video footage for the channel and everything as well. Uh, so we'll be there nice and early. And Yeah, so we'll be there nice and early. Um, come and say hello. We'll say hello to you all as you're coming in and, and whatnot. Um, so we'll see you there. On to <laughs> the giveaway. So, as you know, we've been saying to people, pop a comment in the, for the, in, in the comment section for the last few videos. And we're going to be doing a giveaway which will contain a Terrafosa Blondie, a t-shirt and maybe some other bits and bobs that we decide to just throw in anyway. Um, so we've collated all of the names, we've got the names on a spreadsheet and then we've got a random number picker on Google. We're just going to pick random numbers. If you have commented on all of the videos, which some of you have, uh, other YouTubers obviously they'll normally watch each other's videos and comment on each video. Uh, I have only entered everybody once just to make it fair. Um, obviously because the channel's so small there's not masses of people anyway so everyone's in a good with a good chance of winning. Uh, so let's have a look. Let's flip to the uh, Mac screen and we will see who the lucky winner is. So here we've got the list of people who have commented on the last three videos. Each name has only been entered in once, so there is only 26 names on the list. Um, which is pretty good odds for you winning, to be honest, so good luck to everybody. Let's just quickly find a uh, random number generator. There we go, random number generator. <coughs> we want to change it from minimum 1 to max 26. And when I hit generate, we will reveal who the lucky winner is. So, let's have a look. Number 16, the winner is... Uh, Bug Realms. So, Sam from Bug Realms, you have now won the... T Blondie, um, the t shirt, and any other little bits that we chuck in. So, uh, Sam from Bug Realms, uh, I'll be in contact, mate. Um, well done. Uh, I'll message you on Facebook or over YouTube or something, uh, get your address, and we'll just get the tees uh, and t shirts sent out to you. Um, everybody else, um, sorry, not this time, you didn't win. Uh, however, there will be more giveaways in the future. Keep watching the channel, keep commenting, you know, share the videos. Let's get more subscribers and we'll do another giveaway uh, again anyway. Um, I thought that's the fairest way of doing it, putting everybody's name into a spreadsheet, getting a random number generator um, where everybody can see and whoever wins, wins. Uh, so, uh, make sure you tune in to our next video. Uh, we're going to be having my wife Rachel is going to be unboxing her Portsmouth Tarantula's mystery box. Uh, she's got no choice, she's, she's going to do it. If not, I'll just put it up anyway. Because that's the kind of nice husband that I am. Uh, so make sure you tune into that. Um, and then we'll also get those rehoused with her as well. And I'll be doing some rehousing videos, not from all of the uh, spiders that we got today, but I'll be doing some rehousing videos uh, for some of them. And then we'll also be starting our movie themed um, enclosure project as well. So there's a lot, there's a lot of stuff coming up, guys. Make sure you keep watching. Thank you again. To everybody that we saw today at the show, uh, it was great to meet you all. Thanks again, guys, and I'll see you again soon. Thank you. Coco, come here. Who's that? Please. Look. Who's this?